We want to welcome Maisie Williams back to GMA. You remember her from Game of Thrones. Now she's starting the new series on FX Pistol. Nice to see you. Welcome back. Thank you for having me back. So this is about the Sex Pistols, big punk rock band, like late 70s, 80s, mm -hmm. uh, way before your time, I think. But you played Jordan, who was a real fashion icon yeah, at the exactly. time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, she was. So Jordan was kind of like the physical embodiment of um, Vivian Westwood's shop. And then the Pistols kind of came from an inspiration of that as well. So she was uh, a fashion icon and the images that she created kind of you know live on today in pop culture which is very exciting. Was there one particular look from her that really stood out for you? There were so many but <laughs> I, there was a lot of uh, a lot of rubber stockings and and <laughs> <laughs> and like rubber outfits and there was a particular skirt that when she wore it, she, it was a kind of heat wave in, in London, and she said that the skirt kind of melted off of her. <laughs> it didn't happen to me, thankfully, but um, yeah, that was an incredible outfit and a nice history to sort of know about. Oh, it. we see her right oh, there. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, so this is my rubber, rubber shirt. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, it's so That must have been so much fun to play. It, yeah, just, just incredible. I think, like, you know, working with Danny and being able to tell Steve Jones's story um, was just such. Uh, such an un unbelievable opportunity and for all of us I think uh, getting to sort of dive into the the history of the pistols and and to them as sort of vulnerable children was really nice because we only really know um, kind of the stories that have come since and so it was nice to find some humanity in that yeah that's right do you mind if we show a little bit to yes, the folks? please. okay please. here you go with a new generation gap good for you and how long before you're the old new generation gap what will you have then but a tray boring story about how you were once the brightest young things at some gig no one even remembers? Go home. Learn things. Get clever. Make your own destiny. Ooh. You talk there about bringing humanity and the story to the character, but still the look is so much a part of it as well. What, was, what were the sessions in hair and makeup like? It was a lot, a, yeah. a lot of time. I had multiple wigs and different makeup looks. Um, but for me, I'd never really played a character where I had such a physical transma transformation. You know, I bleached my eyebrows, bleached my hair. So it was, um, yeah, it really felt like something to center myself every day and, and find who Jordan was. And I really appreciated that. I've never been able to rely on that sort of physical transformation before so last time you're here was just before the game of thrones finale what's your favorite souvenir from the set well i was lucky enough to take home my final jacket um and it oh, kind of oh. still covered in rubble yeah it's covered in rubble and fake blood uh yeah. just the way that it was there and for me um yeah that costume signifies a lot and i think the the final look of aria being so broken um yeah i was very grateful to be able to take that jacket with me you said well, got to take home did you take it or did they let you they were they given to you i was gifted uh, by yeah, okay. someone who we okay. were <laughs> yeah. Well, it is great to have you back. We cannot wait to see Pistol. Thanks for coming in. It premieres May 31st with a full season dropping on Hulu. It premieres on FX. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.